that since the Federal Service came into being in 1913, illegally, without a constitutional amendment, by bribing a few senators during Christmas vacation, they turned over the most important power that the American government has, the crea creation and issuance of money, to a private bank. Through that private bank issuing money, they have destroyed this country. They have destroyed the purchasing power of the money in this country. They've created social programs that are destroying this country. They, they have a machine that can make all the money. It's not about money. It's about control. It's about their vision of how they want to see the world. What we want doesn't matter anymore. It's their agenda. It's their plans that matter. So uh, the ultimate goal that these people have in mind is the goal to um, create a one world government run by the banking industry, where everybody has an RFID chip implanted in them. All money is to be um, in those chips, right? There'll be no more cash. And this is getting me straight from Rockefeller himself. This is what they want to accomplish. And all money will be in your chips. And so, any, so not, instead of having cash, any time you have money in your, in, your, in your chip, they can take out whatever they want to take out whenever they want to. And you become a slave. You become a serf to these people. That's their goal. That's their intentions. How they control the media. They control the government. And they're all in bed together. So we, we, you're fighting all this propaganda all the time. And it's a very difficult fight. If we ever want to win this battle, you must shut down the Federal Reserve System. And we must shut down these bankers. Look, we're dealing with complete evil. We're dealing with complete evil. And until the American people wake up and say, we don't want this evil in our country anymore, and we want to come back to a country of decency and goodness and integrity and honor, you know, we're, we're going down that road. But just, folks, you know, all I can say is, you know, take our country back, restore the Constitution, don't let these bankers do this to us anymore. Stand up, don't be afraid of them, and uh, do what you got to do. To be. It takes all Americans to stand together, to stand tall, to mobilize and say, we're not going to take this anymore. I'm mad as hell. I'm not going to take it anymore. We're going to stand up and, and, and fight the battle. And you and I can't do this alone. We're just leaders of the thing. But other people have to join in with us and stand side by side, shoulder to shoulder, and say, I'm not going to take it anymore. That's what it's going to take to win this effort.